Dr. Pumper, you also treat keloid scars. What can you tell us about that? Well, see, that's actually very interesting, especially now. All of a sudden, I've seen an uptick in people interested in getting radiation for their keloids. And I think it's a, it's a very good thing. I mean, it's I don't know why they weren't more uh, knowledgeable about it before, but I think that they're more concerned about having multiple surgical procedures because the high risk of recurrence when you have oper uh, surgery for a keloid. Uh, the radiation therapy is really just three treatments, and it's... Uh, done after the keloid surgery and it can decrease the risk of a recurrence tremendously and there's minimal risk of any problems with the radiation. So I'm actually getting a fair amount of interest from the surgeons who I guess they just really don't want to have to do more surgery if they don't have to. They're telling the patients more that uh, you know radiation is an option. So it's really something people should be aware of. So that's a big win for patients. Yeah. <laughs>